Hi, I'm Nancy Montgomery, and I am running for re-election. Um, there's a lot to be done in Phillipstown. There's a lot of work to finish. Um, I started out as a volunteer in town and sort of had my hands on everything from being a class mom to being on the Recreation Commission to being at the Depot Theater um, and being an EMT. So I've had my, my hand on the pulse of the community um, and I think I can be a good voice and continue to be a good voice for the community. I, I got involved because I liked what was happening in town when I moved back here 10 years ago. Um, the town had a community approach to developing the plans for the future and I saw that and I knew I wanted to be a part of those plans. So we've already um, saw the uh, implementation of our new zoning ordinance which I was a part of and now we have a road map that can be the guide for economic development and, and environmental preservation for our town. We have our small town businesses that, that make up the framework of our community and, and now they have uh, a document where their standards are rooted and we can continue from there. Um, there's a lot of work to be done for our emergency services systems. There's uh, lots of community input that needs to go into that and we need to understand what we need to do to make sure that we can retain those, those services. Um, we, we have been on the road to planning for the future of our town and we're not finished yet. I have a lot of experience in doing that. I've served four years as your councilwoman, um, two as your deputy supervisor, and uh, I think those, those plans that, that we've set down during my term um, are great, but I think there's a lot we need to do to move forward. The challenges are much greater than they were four years ago when I ran. Um, and I think it's time that we petition the state and these other outside forces um, that, that make our lives here more challenging. Um, there's a lot that can be done to relieve some of those mandates that are handed down from the state, some things that we don't have control over. We, we need to um, move forward sort of outside of our boundaries and have a voice um, in who's setting those policies. So I hope you'll vote for me November 8th and I'm, I'm looking forward to continuing to serve you.